Our project is about automatic ration material distribution system using GSM and RFID technology. We are doing this project under the guidance of Professor Padma Shri S. We know that the ration materials have been distributed manually nowadays. The major drawback of this are the weightage of the commodities may be inaccurate and if the material is left over at the end of the month, it will be dispensed to others without the intimation to the government. If the system is automated, we can overcome this. Such a system is our project. Here we are using an RFID card instead of ration card. And the core of our project is ARM7 processor. We have also implemented tampering and fire detection system in our project. You can see the basic model of our project. You can see the container and the circuit construction of our project. Once when the material comes to the ration shop, the message for every customer will be sent through GSM in order to collect the ration. Here you can see in the left corner the RFID transmitter and in the right corner RFID receiver. So it will ask for you to insert the card. Once when the button is pressed, if the frequency matches, it will ask for you to enter the password. You have to enter the password using the hexa keypad. Here our password is 1234. Suppose if your password is wrong, it will, uh, it will show incorrect password and you have the accessibility to enter the password 4 times. If you fail to enter, it will deny your process and the system has to be reset for the second trial. If the, when it asks for you to enter the password, if the password is a correct password, it will allow you to the system to select the commodities. Suppose I select rice The DC motor will run clockwise and the rice will be dispensed and the DC motor will run anti-clockwise. Suppose if I select the kerosene, the sprinkler motor gets activated and the kerosene will be dispensed. You can see the kerosene dispensing. You can see the probe sensors which has been connected to the container. Once when the connection of this probe sensor is removed, it will be sensed and the red LED glows and the buzzer gets activated. This is a temperature detection sensor. Once when the temperature rises above 80 degrees Celsius, it will be detected and the LED will glow and the buzzer will get activated and that message will be sent to the nearest person through GSM. This is a GSM model. It will communicate with the ARM7 using 80 commands. All the messages of tamper detection system and a fire alarm system will be sent through GSM. And also the messages about the commodities dispensed along with the Aadhaar number of that specific person will be sent to the government so that even a single grains statistics would not be missed. By using this system, we can overcome the corruption to certain extents. It is a very helpful system for our society. 
Our project is about automatic.